What's going on everyone? Jers here with another Dynasty Warriors 8 gameplay. Uh, this time I'll be doing a guide on how to level up quickly and let's get started. I'm going to show you what you need, what stage you need and I'll tell you how you're going to unlock the stage. First of all it's with the Wei Army and it's over here the Battle of Baidi Castle. It's actually the last mission on the hypothetical route. Uh, if you do not have all the stars to unlock the hypothetical route to get to this stage, I have star guides for the Way Kingdom. Be sure to follow them and get your hypothetical missions and get this stage because you're going to level up everyone quick as hell with this. So let's get started. Put it on beginner. Uh, find a character that's low level. For me, I have Jang Fei at level 16. And I highly suggest putting a weapon on them that is actually very fast attacking so it's a lot faster so it helps you level up much quicker so we're gonna just grab him anything here we'll just grab him that and someone that attacks very quickly would be Jia Chong's weapons I mean he doesn't have many stars on him but it's still very good and let's grab him a decent one here let's just take that one and we'll switch his main weapon put it to that all right select skills I highly suggest you take quick learner with you for the additional XP so you can level up even faster and these are all fine here select animal I'm gonna take the red here so I can get there even faster and begin battle and what I'm gonna do is just skip all events skip everything that I can and just try to show you guys how to get there uh, pretty much you need to fulfill several timelines before you can even do anything at the beginning <clears throat> Before you can even get to the location So let's just skip everything And bringing the red hair is a great idea because you run so damn slow All right, let's go And let's just clear everything here at the start Got it. We will use a fire attack. Let's get off our horse. We can kick a little more ass off of our horse. There we go. And then here is the little fire attack. Complete all these little beginner missions. Little lag. Don't worry about that. It's just a fire. And then the lag, the frames should get much better out here. There you go. And now there's going to be a general up here to defeat. And this should control the fire attack. There we go. Now head up north because now they're going to start sending reinforcements. We'll an escape boat to the north and it'll be Zhao Yun in here. And you're going to be waiting up here for a while. I can tell you that much. There's going to be several events up here. So let's just be patient. And let's see how fast Jia Chong's weapon is. Pretty decent speed. Now, also, I've been reading guides. I did not find this out on my own, guys. Just to let you know. I did not find this out on my own. I've been reading guides and <clears throat> taking tips from subscribers as well. And I did not find this on my own. People told me about it. I decided to try it. I tried it. It worked out. And here I am. I'm going to do a video for you guys now. So you wait up here for the timeline to catch up to itself. As soon as they say let's counteract or let's flank uh, Li Jian, I believe, or Jiang, Jian Yang. I'm not really sure on his name. They're going to decide, let's use this boat up here, and we're going to just take it from him. Jian Yong, there you go. He's activating Arbalist. The Wei Kingdom cannot go in through the center. So they're going to have us go around behind him, and we're just going to take this, take this boat from him. So let's let the timeline fulfill itself. And when we finally get to the location, I'm going to show you guys my current level and just show you just how quick I'm going to level up in that area. There we go. Snatching ships. Even Shahodun thinks it's a cool idea. He's like, not a bad idea. Seize the escape boat. 
And then as soon as this little baby clip right here is done, we're going to be able to board the ship. It's going to move into position, like so. And as soon as we get on, a whole bunch of troops are going to teleport on here with us. And there we go. Now the boat will start moving shortly. And you just wait here by the gun, because they're going to have you shoot down those three arbalists there. Fire the ballisti! <clears throat> Sometimes the ballisti gets a little weird here and starts shooting at random stuff. I don't know, like it starts flying to the sky on the last one for me sometimes. There we go, got it. And just wait here because Guan Ping is going to jump onto your ship now. There, we just skip that. He actually jumped on a ship before I even thought he was going to. And just wait for the ship to finally land and we're going to be at our level up location very soon. Be patient guys, we're almost there. And I like these little animations the boats have, man, it's pretty cool. As soon as we get off the ship, get on your horse. There we go. Jang Fei is one slow mofo, so I do suggest taking the fastest horse in the game if you have them. If you don't, take any horse you have uh, available. So let's get this battle going with all these guys down here. Alright, let's battle it out with Guan Yu. Battle it out with Jang Fei. Two more guys here to battle with. And let's go all the way to Jong Yong. There's another general here. Join in, buddy. Join in. And here we go. And let's get started, man. Let's just start putting people down into into their graves. And there we go. And I get to duel with myself. Because that's just what a cool guy does. And let's hit him with another Musu. Boom. Alright, everyone's defeated. Get on your horse. You could pick up the stuff if you want, but let's just get straight to the place, right? So as soon as you defeat them, go back to where your original base is. Your forces are going to move up, and they're going to set up uh, catapults for you. Don't worry about the catapults for now. You're going to you know, you're gonna get to level 99 before you even worry about the catapults. So you're going to head all the way to the south. And we are going to get to Yu Ying right now. We're going to run past all these generals and get straight to Yu Ying. I can't believe I lost. Yeah, don't worry about it, buddy. You lost to yourself, so it's not that bad. So just run past everybody so your troops have someone to battle while you're running through. Let, let them all just run by. Don't worry about these guys. Just run by, run by. Let them battle whoever the hell they want down here. And we're going to run straight to Yu Ying. And then here is where the magic happens. Alright. Defeat Yu Ying. Alright. And defeat a Juggernaut. And let's see if we can get this one to spawn over here. Not yet. Let's defeat the other Juggernaut. Here we go. <laughs> Ming Ho actually died really quick this time. There we go. This is what you want. Now, switch to your fast attack and weapon. These are going to continue spawning here. And before we actually do this, look at my level. I'm level 18 right now. Look at the time. 53 minutes. This is going to be your level up glitch here, guys. And you can just sit here and basic attack it the entire time. And just level up. You don't have to do anything special, just keep attacking it. And they're going to keep spawning here. Pretty much forever. Let the timeline go. As soon as the timeline's done, they should start spawning in again. There we go. As soon as they shut up, notice they come right back. So you keep doing this. 
And let's see how long it takes us. We're gonna check. I'm gonna check in about two minutes. See what level I am in about two minutes or so. I, I don't know. Let's see. So let's just keep doing this. Boom. Use any weapon you feel comfortable with. Though I do like this weapon, it does attack pretty quickly. But if you have velocity on something, knock yourself out, guys. For real. It'll help out so much more. There you go. Just let her hurry up with her little tiger thing and be quiet. And now we're back. Now, you could probably defeat all those generals over there, but I just do it so uh, my officers don't come over here and bother me. So, there we go. So, we were level 18 when we started at 53 minutes. Let's give it about one more minute or so before we, uh, before we check our stats here, see what level we are. But as you can see, pretty much every few seconds I'm leveling up here. Every full S-string. Boom. Another S-string. Bam. Level up again. Look at that. And this will also help if your siege weapon kills. Because this all counts as siege weapon kills. For those of you that need that trophy. The 1,000 siege weapon uh, trophy kills. The 1,000th trophy kills. The 1,000 siege weapon destructions. You have to destroy 1,000 siege weapons and you get a trophy. Yes, I see why you're the greatest, Shen Fei. Alright. Alright, let's take a look at our level. We have grown 21 levels. And what time is it? It's been 3 minutes. We've grown 21 levels in 3 minutes, people. Do you know how insane that is? We were level 18 when we got here. So, this is awesome, isn't it? So let's see how long it takes us to get to 99. I'm gonna try to check every two minutes or so, see what level I am. Look at that, look at the levels just exploding right now. I can't hold out much longer. Don't worry about your NPCs dying, your, uh, your, your team. They're of no concern, all we care about is leveling up right now, isn't that right? So let's get in here, keep chopping this thing down. There you go. Let the timeline get the hell out of the way, because every time you get a kill, it's going to update and it's going to interrupt your uh, little spawns here. Not that big a deal. So in about another minute or so, we're going to check and see what level we are. Boom, just keep ripping this thing up here. Go. We're back. Some more of these bad boys. Just keep basic attacking it. You can do whatever you want. You can move if you want it. You can use your uh, your rage. I'm just using basics because I mean, why? Why not? It's just it's relaxing. I can just sit here do whatever. Keep doing this. Get to 99. Very easy. Looking good, looking good. And let's check our progress. We are level 75 now, and we started, what, at 53 we got here? So we've been here a little under four minutes, uh, about four minutes, 30 seconds, a little under five minutes, correction, and we are level 75. We're gonna check back in another two minutes, see what happens. Well, roughly two minutes, I might, you know, so let's see what happens. Let's see if we can how long it's gonna take us to get to 99. Now do you see why I'm the greatest warrior in the Oh, I see why you're the greatest. Because of this level up glitch, baby. Oh. Senji's got defeated, don't worry about it. She's no one important. It's just Salfi's wife. So, you know. Alright, 
about another minute or so. We're going to check our stats. And look at that. Our, our generals are going to end up beating them anyway without our help. So there we go. We're back here. Some more kills for us. Timeline. And there you go. Right back into it. There we go, right back at it, just keep beating it up, and we're going to check our progress here in about another minute or so. Not another minute, not, not too long, we're going to check very soon. Look at this, oh, leveling up like crazy now. Alright, let's see where we are, we are level 98 right now. Level 98, guys. Look at this. Let's just get that last level and see how much time it was. There we go. We're done. It took us... 7 minutes, under 7 minutes, to get about 80 levels up, uh, 80 levels down here in this stage. So that's about it, guys. From here, once you hit level 99, just simply finish the stage, and that'll be that. Thanks for watching, and I hope this level up guide helped you guys.